Cuba scored a victory Friday during the second round of negotiations with the United States after Washington announced it would remove the island nation from its list of sponsors of terrorism. At the press conference following the talks aimed to normalize bilateral ties between the two countries, Cuban Representative Josefina Vidal reiterated the importance of this agreement before both nations can begin to open embassies in each other's capitals. Roberta Jackson, the U.S. Assistant Secretary of State for Western Hemisphere Affairs, echoed the call, saying that her country is reviewing the terror list and will remove Cuba before April. For us, it would, be, uh, it would be difficult to explain that Cuba and the U.S. have uh, reestablished normal diplomatic relations while Cuba is ke kept uh, uh, in that uh, list that we believe uh, we have never belonged to.